Uh, good morning, uh, students. Uh, good morning to all of you. Today we have to discuss question number forty-two. Let us see here question number forty-two. Okay. Uh, five years since a man's age will be three times the age of his son. Okay. Uh, five years since means uh, uh, five years later or five years after the man's age will be three times the age of his son. Uh, five years ago the man's uh, man was seven times as old as his son. Find the percentage. Yes. And five years ago, uh, the man's age will be seven times old as son. Find the percentages. Okay, let us see. Here. First of all, you have to assume the percentages of the son and the uh, man's uh, x and y. Okay, let us assume uh, <coughs> the present is the present age of a man that is equal to x years. Okay, and the present age present age of Uh, his son that is equal to y years okay uh, five years ago is according to the question five years later or five years since a man's five years after uh, a man's age will be a uh, three times the age of his son so then uh, five after five years okay here you can write here after five years okay after five years man's age Man's age how much? After five years, man's age how much? Present age is x. After five years, it will becomes x plus five. And uh, after five years, after five years, after five years, uh, y's or son, uh, son's age will become y plus five. Again, here according to question, question tells us. After five years or a five years since a man's age will be three times the age of his son. So according to the question, you can write here man's age. Man's age means x plus five and y plus five. You have to equate the man's age will be three times. This will become three times. So you have to multiply by three into his into his son's age so that it will be equate. Uh, here this implied that x plus five equal to three y plus three five yeah, fifteen. Okay, I think you are able to follow me. X minus three y becomes fifteen minus five. It will go and becomes a negative sign. X minus three y becomes ten. This will gives an equation. That is equation number one. Again, this is the first part of the part of the uh, questions. In the second part, uh, in the second parts, uh, five years ago. Okay, five years ago. Five years ago, this was the second part. Okay, five years ago, uh, man's age, man's age, how much the man's age? Because of the first present age of the man is x. Uh, before five years, how much x minus five? I think you are able to follow me. Five years ago, okay, five years ago, okay, x minus five, and uh, his son age, his son's age, how much? Five years ago, present age is y. Uh, before five years, it will become so y minus five. Okay, again, uh, questions tells that according to the questions, uh, the man was seven times as old as his son. Means uh, the x minus five equal to y minus five. You want to equate this? Means the questions tells that the man was seven times. The man was this one x minus five. The man said the man was seven times old his son. So. Seven is multiplied by his son's age, so that it will be equate. So after it, you have to solve seven y minus seven five yeah, thirty five. Okay, here x minus seven y minus thirty five plus becomes plus five, and gives an equation that is x minus seven y minus thirty. Equation number two. It gives an equation that is equal to two. Uh, here x and here also x. So Use uh, simply subtract one minus two, and gives x minus three y. X minus three y equal to ten, and x minus seven y equal to minus thirty. Okay, x minus three y equal to ten. X minus seven y equal to minus thirty. You have to subtract minus plus plus. Okay, this will cancel out, and it will gives a value that is plus. 4y, okay. 7 minus 3 that is plus 4y, and it will give a value that is plus 20, okay. Plus 
plus 20 no, no 40 40 sorry this one plus 30 and plus 10 becomes 40 okay and the 4 will be cancel out by 4 it is 1 times that is 4 1 4 then y becomes equal to 10 years this one the age of his son this one the age of his son son's age okay again if you putting the value of y in 1 putting the value putting the value of y in 1 then what will you get x minus 3 x minus 3 into y that is the value of 10 and it will become how much x equal to 10 plus 30 this one 30 go in the another side becomes plus x equal to 40 years and this is the age of his man's age okay i think it is clear up to which you are able to follow me thank, thank you very much